Is that all? What's up, studs and chats? What's up, studs and chats? Our first clip is truly a gem. Hit that like. really thought he was playing GTA 6. You can see in the beginning there was a car, the same truck that was appearing. It intercepted him. He's minding his own business, getting some sugar in, and then all of a sudden the truck comes into play and boom, gets that tackle, intercepts the car, takes a look. Okay, that's a job well done. Takes another bite to it, claps his hand, takes a tissue, and that's a job done, right? That's a job done. Seriously, folks, looking at this narrow ass road, Good luck being stuck for two hours. And apparently a lot of people are saying that they have seen people getting stuck on the road bay for two to four hours. That's the best thing ever, man. I love getting stuck. I love getting... <laughs> This video was posted two days ago on that name that song. He just wanted to know the name of that song. We got this hooded ass horse. Look at look at how my boy is calm. Just getting those cigs, getting those puff puffs in. And you're like, bro, I wanna know that song. I wanna know that song. The disrespect of this horse is unreal, man. And you know what? Everybody loves a good old classic, right? Like that. But speaking of people appreciating the hood, there's no better place than Siberia. <laughs> So we just got a normal day in Siberia. It's snowing hard. We got this white horse. This We got this brown horse. That's racist! Oh, my bad, that might be racist. So what I was saying was that we got this chocolate horse and we got this vanilla horse. Both Bruh. of them are looking at each other, about to do something. And bam, bam, bam! There's a kick, there's a kick! The horse couldn't walk, but he's trying to run from it. But the white horse, uh, and then we got another horse in the back. Maybe that's a guy, maybe that's not a horse. I'm not sure. The horse is trying to walk away, but the other horse had look and RKO out of nowhere. Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out! Watch out, watch out. And then look at that slam, god damn it, a choke slam. The guy in the car is like, okay, that's enough filming for the day. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna be getting a lot of karma over on right. And then there's another one. There's a, he's uh, humping his uh, pee pee. And the guy just rolls his car and goes away. This is some t-shirt level weather for horses in Siberia. And this video right here, it gives anxiety. Check this out. <laughs> me or you were also waiting for a speeding truck to come in guys it's really a miracle that he didn't slip and fall and he went all the way down there and you know this is probably how them ancestrals uh, canadians probably started hockey but in all seriousness thankfully there was no speeding truck that would have been the worst way to go but we have a karen that unleashes uh, or uh, unleash unleashed his full toxic masculinity roll it i got a kid in my car and you're driving like so you want to videotape me? F you. Is that all? <sighs> this is truly sad because I really wish I had some of you punching that like button like that man. <gasps> Moral of the story, you always gotta tell them you're recording. This is how you're gonna break their EXE and you're gonna get clips for your TikToks. But click on this video on the screen to see the last episode or click on the video on the left where this guy thought he was playing GTA 6 in real life and it doesn't end well. 